following match is a part of the I-70 series. Welcome back to the NWO Kansas City from the Scottish Rite Temple. And we have an I-70 Series tag team match for all you great fans at home. Des Wellston and Maverick are going to take on the Royal Blood. Well, you know what? I think I think Royal Blood are in deep trouble. I mean, you have Jackson Jet. Yeah, sure, they like to do their flips. They like to do their athletic maneuvers. But you got Wellston and Maverick coming here. I mean, the power these guys bring from that side of the state. I think the Royals are in deep trouble, Ben. Look at the look on Des Wellston's face. Des Wellston usually, no matter if he's in Kansas City or St. Louis, he likes to high five all the fans. This is a different Des Wellston. He looks almost, almost he almost has a look of disdain on his face coming out here in front of the fans of the Scottish Rite Temple. Well, as the as NWO has as NWO started, it has you know become obvious that the St. Louis and Kansas City side, there's just a bigger wedge driven each and every week. And you know, you talk to some of these guys in the St. Louis roster, they, they're they starting to hate coming to Kansas City. They don't think they get respected here and vice versa. So, and look at this, Maverick, he, he always has a look at disdain on his face here. Yeah, no matter if he's here in St. Louis, the new champion, the new champion of STL is that man right there, Maverick, and it happened under auspicious circumstances. Last time we were in the Castle Loma Ballroom, there has been an attitude change, a, sure. a, a, a changing of the guard as a whole in the STL, if you will. A lot of things going on on the other side of the I-7. Yeah, we see Todd Letterman, who was the first champion, drops the title in that triple threat match to Maverick, who is now the St. Louis champion. He gets the decisive victory over Letterman and Cornell Douglas, and now he's teaming up with Des Wellston here. As he said, take it on these, these two little pretty boys that Kansas City fans love, and I and Wellston and Maverick love to hate. Stop dancing their music. I mean, come on. You're from California. You're not cool enough to dance to this. I love these guys. There they are. Jet and Jack's Royal, the Royal Blood. And they are probably, without a doubt, the most loved tag team, the most loved wrestlers here in uh, NWL KC. And I cannot wait for this matchup. They are looking forward to getting another victory for Kansas City in the I-70 series. Look at them, hugging guys, kissing babies. <laughs> really just makes me sick. Look at that, NWL KC is number one. There's so many fans, so many great fans here. Love this these guys can spell. Oh, stop it. Look, the crowd loves these guys, I get it. They're very entertaining, exciting to watch. But have you seen Des Wilson? Des Wilson and Maverick had a great match together against each other in St. Louis. I can only imagine what these two are gonna, the punishment they're gonna dole out to the, to the Royal Blood. We'll see. You've seen Maverick, you saw him in that championship match. You don't think he's gonna destroy these guys? Maverick definitely has, let's go Once to again, the Once this match the is part of the I-70 series in which NWLKC leads St. Louis 13 to 10. Introducing first, representing St. Louis, weighing 210 pounds, hailing from St. Louis, Missouri, he is Dez Wilston! Crowd loves him, obviously. Dez Wilston and his is partner, shooting a terrible look Weighing in at 240 pounds, hailing from Georgetown, Texas. He is the son of Texas. He is the raging bull. He is the St. Louis champion. He is Maverick. Maverick has stated and on numerous opponents, occasions. Weighing in at a combined 340 pounds. From right here in Kansas City, Missouri. Oh, come on. They are Jet and Jack's Royal, the Royal Blood. Maverick has stated on numerous occasions oh, that, that he, does, he doesn't have a particular side in this I-70 series. Maverick is here to collect championships, and to him, I believe it just so oh, happens that he is on the NWL-STL roster. I said, what is up, Kansas City? 
Oh, don't cut off these guys, Ben. I mean, I really want to hear what they have to say. I'm sure most of you guys saw what happened last time we were in this ring. So I'm gonna keep this short and sweet. And be sure to tuck your thumbs, because this is a shoot. Oh, boy. If all you fans were living under a rock, you didn't hear that NWL STL is dead. Now, oh, come on. Can we even talk about that? Just hating on St. Louis some more. This is, this, this is disgraceful. A lot of people here are wondering why. There's a lot of, you know, trigger fingers on the internet. Well, I'll give you a reason why. You see the front row right here? You see all these fans? There's more fans in this front row than there were at any of the STL shows. Wow, strong words. So take that back to St. Louis. Just plain mean. Oh, the crowd starting to get really, really behind Kansas City here. They love this I-70 series. But there's two men from St. Louis that we're not done with. Gibson and Grundy, or whatever they want to call themselves now. I don't, I don't even care. You can be at any bum fed of this side of the Mississippi, but you better watch your back, because we're coming for you guys. Well, you know there's a big history already in the NWO with Royal Blood and Blood Brothers, and you know who's always on top. It's always the Blood Brothers. Blood Brothers ever the opportunist. Last time we were here in the Scottish Rite Temple, pushing that ladder over, taking out Jet and Jack's Royal and allowing the Howlets to grab those contracts in that ladder match and that kept the Howlets paid for another year probably here in the NWL. And referee Nick Chin has called for the bell and we are underway for this I-70 series matchup, Des Wellston and Maverick. And one has to wonder, considering the wars Wellston and Maverick have engaged in, are they going to be able to coexist long enough to take out the royal blood, Jet and Jack's royal Oh, I think that their disdain for Kansas City's side of the state, their roster over here at NWLKC is enough for these two to put their differences aside if they had any. And look at this, Maverick just putting it to both of the twins. Nice leapfrog. Maverick, Maverick is so intense. Everything he does, oh, and oh, he just got his head rammed into that security railing. Come on, Maverick. Jet, Jet Royal taking exception to being hit off the apron by Maverick earlier. Nice Hurricane Rana takes Maverick over, and Des Wellston makes his way into the ring with a palm strike and a kick to the midsection. Look at that. I mean, the Royal Blood goofing around. They had the upper hand, but now, oh, Des Wellston gets it, but flying take forearm it right by Jet Royal clocked him right in the face. And you got to keep your eyes on the royal blood at all time because you never know where they're going to come with. Look at these guys posing into the crowd. You know, Maverick and Dez, have, I've never, I don't know if they've ever tagged before. I mean, these guys, look at this. See, now, I mean, there's already a, a, a sense of, of, of uneasiness between the team of Wellston and Maverick. And one has to wonder. Is this going to explode right here in the Scottish Rite Temple in front of all these Kansas City fans? If it does, Fight STL will not get a victory here tonight over the tag team of the Royal Blood. Well, STL pulling in closer, 13 to 10. They just trailed by a few now. I mean, that, that the gap has been shortened by so much. And I don't like seeing that. I don't like seeing the guys getting into it each other. Maverick and Wilson need to stay on the same page. They need to take out the Royals tonight. Des Wilson now in there against Jet Royal. Kick right to the midsection. Des Wilson again. There's this incredulous look on his face. Like he would rather be anywhere else than here in the Scottish Rite Temple right now. Well, and one has to wonder after the 
week's recent events with NWL STL, if that's factoring into his mindset in this match. Well, of course it is. I mean, you sit here and you have the, the Royal Bloods in there ripping on his hometown. I mean, he's from Wellston, which is obviously part of St. Louis. They just sit there and say horrible things about his town. He definitely doesn't like coming here. Look at this. Nice kip-ups. Face-off by De Wellston and Jet here. Jet leapfrogs over, drops down. Wellston oh. gets caught with a drop kick right on the button. Jet Royal showing why they are so loved here in the Scottish Rite Temple, especially in Kansas City. High-flying moves just like that. Snapmare takeover by Jet Royal. And Wellston's in trouble now. Look at this nice double-team action here. Tagging in his brother. Low. Low hanging blockbuster and a springboard elbow drop connects right with the sternum of Des Wellston going for a cover here. Well, Jack's coming in now and working over Wellston. Maverick needs to get in there and tag in his partner soon. Look at this, Knights. This is what the brothers have that Wellston and, and Maverick don't have. Snap suplex and a rolling senton over the top rope. Look at Yo, that. Just steps on him. Assisted <laughs> moonsault. <laughs> Lands right on the face of Des Wellston, and now a standing shooting star press connects. Jet Royal going up. for a cover. Oh, thank goodness. If Maverick didn't go in there, I thought it was over. This crowd needs to learn to respect. This guy's a champion in this company. Again, like I said before, Maverick did capture that title with a little bit of assistance, if you will. So let's not give a lot of credit to Maverick. Maverick did have some help what? capturing that STL title. Look at, this. Look at this. It is amazing to watch Royal Blood in action. I will give them credit for that. And they are doing, the guys that are double their size, it doesn't matter. They're so quick. They're so in tune with each other. They know exactly what they're doing. Oh, Maverick cutting off Jet Royal and slamming him spine first into that hard steel post on the outside. Maverick again taking opportunity where Nick Chin's back is turned. And now Des Wellston, what is he going to do here to capitalize on that? Dropping the elbow right on the arm and the bicep of Jet Royal. And it seems like that's what Maverick should do. I mean, Maverick has to do moves like that. The brothers had too much momentum. He obviously had to take one of them when the ref wasn't looking and just ram him into that post. Jet Royal has that K-tape on that, that right arm and shoulder. That's going to be a huge target for somebody like Maverick sure. and Dez Wellston. They're going to fire away on that arm and try to take out maybe some sort of injury during training that Jet Royal received. Yeah, why don't you just tell me where to hit you? Just put the tape exactly where I know you're vulnerable. That's smart. You think that's smart? I don't think you would have the guts to step in the ring, so I don't know why you're saying give me a target. Well, I'll just put tape all over me. Hard knife edge chop. Maverick, oh, <laughs> goodness gracious. Maverick spitting in the face of Jax Royal. And now referee Nick Chin has to use all of his Look at body this weight to keep, going down. keep Jax Royal out of the ring. Maverick, one of the hardest choppers, if not the hardest chopper, in the NWL. If spitting was an Olympic event, Maverick, he's got the gold, buddy. Now it looks like Wellston and Maverick have found common ground here and are working symbiotically here to take out Jet and Jax Royal. Come on, Des, wear him down. Jet Royal's in trouble now. Jet Royal trying to get, that's a tight rear chin lock that Des Wellston has applied. Choke him. To Jet Royal, and Jet Royal, the more he's in there with Maverick and Wellston, the more energy he's going to expend, no, 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 even no, doing no. things like this. Look at that, Maverick, try, look. What is, what is Maverick doing? I think there was a tag made, and Maverick. What is going on? No, no one saw it. No, the referee did not see that tag. The referee being able to tell the twins apart is saying that there was no tag made. How smart is that? Maverick using using his his best judgment to throw off referee Nick Chin. And now this is an assisted suplex. And he drives Jet Royal into the mat. Jet Royal taking more punch. How smart was that decoy move by Maverick? He wasn't able to tag out. And now Jet's in big trouble. Maverick feigning a spill into the ring and that distracted referee Nick Chin just enough for him not to see that tag. Smart move by the champ. Just when I thought I've seen every decoy in professional wrestling history, I see Maverick do that. I mean, this guy is brilliant. Oh, 
And here come those stinging left jabs by the raging bull, Maverick, the son of Texas. Look at the really, snap on that. Really laying it into Jet Royal, and now Jet Royal's in a part of the ring. He does not want to be, and that's the opposition corner here. If he stays in this corner, this match should be over shortly. Well, Jet fighting back now, but wrong part of town, big boot. Oh, a hard clubbing form to the spine of Jet Royal. Look at Maverick. This guy hits you so hard. Even those forms got to take it out of you. Right right got him hooked up for a beautiful, almost threw Jet Royal out of the ring. Exploder suplex. Such massive power lies in those arms over. of Maverick. Oh, come on. If he would hook the leg, it was over. It was. Again, smartly going back to that taped up shoulder of Jet Royal is Maverick. And that's one of the reasons why he is the NWL STL champion is because he pays attention. Maverick always has a game plan going, going into his matches and will fight tooth and nail to make sure that he stays the champion Des or Wilson. wins in whatever matchup he is. Des Wilson coming in with that big boot there. I mean, Maverick and Wilson definitely in control right now. The brothers are in trouble. St. Louis is about to climb within two. Clubbing blow right to that injured shoulder once again. Jet Royal needs to make the tag. If they expect to stay in this match, and look at him scratching and clawing up to a vertical base, firing some good forms on, right into Des. the face of Des Wellston. And Des Wellston once again blocks in the head. A nice yes. judo throw over and right, goes right back to that arm. Now you, you were thinking that Des and Maverick weren't going to have a symbiotic relationship out here. Looks pretty good right now, doesn't it? Absolutely, the Fight STL team are communicating well. They're making quick tags in and out, and they're isolating the ring so Jet Royal can't make that tag to his brother. Oh, big boot, oh, come on, Dez. Puts the boot up. What is he going for here? I oh, thought he could be going for that Tornado DDT and just gets dumped unceremoniously into the center of the ring. Dez, every time I think he's in trouble, he finds a way out of it. Now tagging in Maverick, and now I think this is the end. The Raging Bull comes in and stomps on that shoulder and bicep of Jet Royal. Jet Royal in so much trouble here at the hands of Maverick and Des Wellston. And look at him just... Look, screaming oh. at him, telling his brother to look at him as he's writhing in pain. Come on, you think Jax Royal's going to come do something about that with Maverick? Now stop with this. This crowd should be censored. St. Louis sucks chant ringing out throughout yeah, the Scottish Rite. You really right have to temple. say that? Well, that's what they're chanting. I don't tell you. Oh, you're still going to say everything they chant? Not everything. Yeah. Jet, Jet Royal trying desperately to make the tag to Jax Will. He's so close. And he rolls Come off on. Maverick. One, no, 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 no. two. Thank goodness. Sunset flip pin unable to hold the champion down. And he kicks Maverick in the face after missing that Insiguri on Des Walston. And once again, trying to scrape and crawl back to his corner. He may have got loose there. And dang it, Jax Royal gets pulled off the apron by Maverick. Man, every time the Jet has to be so frustrated now that every time he thinks he's going to be able to tag out, he can't quite get there. Tag team move here. Big running boot and almost a Death Valley driver gets a two count on Jet Royal. Jax Royal making the save for his twin brother. That was over if Jax wouldn't have come in and ruined it for Maverick. Maverick just manhandling Jet in there now. In there far too long. You can see the wear and tear on Jet Royal's face. He is exhausted after taking this onslaught of punishment from the team of Maverick and Des Wellston. And now Dez back in there. You talk about quick tags in and out. I mean, Dez and Maverick continue to work like they've been a well-oiled tag machine for a very long time. And Jet Royal's going to the top turnbuckle. What's he got in store now? Setting him up on the top turnbuckle. He could be going for that belly-to-back superplex. If he hits this, Jet Royal could be finished in this matchup. And they would pick up a huge win for STL. Able to battle out of it. Battling out of it. <laughs> Reverse blockbuster coming off the top rope. Amazing agility by Jet Royal. Able to do that move with that injured shoulder. And now Des Wellston really feeling the effects of that top rope move. 
And both men down, they're starting to count. I mean, who is going to get to, the, get to the corner first? Come on, Dez. I don't think we've seen Jax Royal in this match more than a few minutes. He's I don't got, think I've seen Jet it. Royal in this much pain. He's fresh as a daisy. If he makes this tag, look at that oh, kip up. Come Those on. fans rallied behind him and a big tag to Jax Royal. And Jax Royal coming in the ring, flipping over Maverick. And now takes him down, takes the champ down with a clothesline and a, oh. and a sling play nicely executed by the fresh Jax Royal. Now Dez getting in some shots. He jacks in trouble, no. Oh, kick right to the stomach. Jet Royal may be finding his second win, helping his brother Jax here. What are they doing? What is this? Picks him up and an assisted spike DDT drills Dez Wellston right into the middle of the mat. What a double T move by the Royal Blood. And look, and they sit there and act like they've been in control. They finally have turned the tides. I mean, this is what's been going on the entire time. Maverick and Wilson have dominated this match. Oh my goodness, keep your eye on the Royal Blood. Double toe pays over the top rope. But unfortunately, Maverick yeah. and Wellston have caught them. What's going to happen here? And they're trying to, oh, and then the miscommunication. And now watch the Royal Bloods take no. flight. Double toe pay called hellos. Come on! Did you see? It looked like it looked like Jax Royal landed weird on that, and like you have Maverick and Desert both down. Jax Royal landed weird. I, I I couldn't quite see it from my vantage point, but it looks like Jax Royal may have landed on his right knee, and he is writhing in pain on the mat right now. Come on, his Jet Royal! Oh, I'm sorry, his left knee. Jet Royal is checking on his brother, but in the meantime, Maverick and Dez are still out after that double team maneuver by the Royals. And look, Jet rolling in. Maverick, what's going to happen? Jax Royal can't even make his way back up to his feet. Jet Royal in the ring now, going one on one with Maverick. Oh, and Maverick oh. takes his head off with one of those vicious lariats. Look at that. I mean, folded him in half. And now Maverick, could he be going for, the, if he hits this, if he hits the running gory bomb and he calls the short shot, this could be over for the Royal Blood. He uh -oh. has him high above his head and drops him. The short shot connects. Maverick going for a cover. One, two, three. And that's it. Maverick and Des Wilson have stunned everybody here in the Scottish Rite Temple and pick up a huge win over the Royal Blood. St. Louis pulls within two matches. It's now 13-11, Kansas City, but what a comeback by St. Louis and Maverick, the new champ. But the big story here is what's, what happened to Jax Royal. Jax Royal laying on the outside and has not made his way back up to his feet. We hope to give you a medical update sometime in this broadcast about the condition of Jax Royal. Des Wellston standing alone in the middle of the ring. Maverick's already out of there. Even his partner, and there, and there you see it. Jax Royal in definite pain. It looked like he was nursing that left knee. Jet checking him out with both referees Todd Kutchman and Nick Chin. And here comes President Major Bayston. There's a look of concern on his face. And are we, we got to go to commercial. We'll be right back here on the NWL. What's up, guys? This is Jet Royal, one half of the Royal Blood. And if you like what you just saw, flip on over to the next page and click right here. And while you're at it, subscribe too. Click right here. Come on, click it. You can do it. Don't be lazy. Click it.